Hey, what is up guys? Mr. The Reverts here and man today I got something really cool to show you So as you may know unless you have been living under a rock for the past couple of days DLC 1 has came out for Call of Duty World War 2 and I actually did a review on the DLC If you want to go check it out, there's gonna be a link down below But a day before the DLC release on the 29th of this month Call of Duty released a live-action trailer to kind of promote the DLC a little bit Which is pretty rare to happen for a DLC usually there's only a live action trailer that comes out to promote the entire game before release but anyways within that trailer there's a couple of hidden easter eggs that tells you to go to a certain location on some of the multiplayer maps for the resistance dlc the first one is going to be at 32 seconds in the video and there's a note that says doni b nita and higley which apparently is navajo for a musical instrument and on the map occupation there's an accordion in the center apartment building and the code says cw B Y E, and then you take that code and you go onto the Call of Duty.com slash World War II slash classified website and you enter the code in there. And once you do that, a message will show up that says resist. And then for the next code, it's going to be at 11 seconds in the video. Basically, these two guys are communicating with each other through Morse code in an elevator, and that code translates to Molotov, which is in reference to a Molotov crate on the map Anthropoid. And to find it, you have to go into this little river area and there's going to be a hidden room there and in that room you can find the crate with the code NSUWE and the same thing as before you enter the code in on the website and another message will show up that says stance so the message we have so far is resistance and uh, finally the last code is going to be at 43 seconds in the video and in that scene there's a little meeting between uh, a couple people and everyone in the uh, scene is going over like the little strategy I guess but on the desk there's there's a map that says Operation Valkyrie, which obviously is referring to the map Valkyrie from the DLC. But on the map, there's a red X and the word briefcase. So on Valkyrie, the location for the briefcase is going to be in a tiny room, which can be found by walking through the alleyway and then taking a right and then a left. And the code says ZZPJX. And then when you enter the code in on the website, the message says is now and your screen turns black and a note on a clipboard pops up and you want to click on the resistance in Tell. But the entire message is gonna say resistance is now so pretty cool and then when you click on that little note on the clipboard a file comes up with Intel on every single map from the multiplayer DLC and it talks about the terrain you're playing on the weather for each map and some other really cool information like tips on how to play but then there's another file that you can access by clicking the arrows on the bottom and the title says first in first to win well done soldier now claim wait for it your calling card so after all of that work and searching the only thing you get is a calling card but the funny thing is if you click on the file it's going to bring you to the call of duty.com code redemption site which apparently you have to enter a code in but i'm not sure where you get that code i checked my email that is linked up with the call of duty.com website and i didn't get anything there so i'm not sure how to even get the calling card without a code but to be honest i don't really care all that much like it, it, it's just a calling card i wish the reward would have been a little bit better maybe like a cool skin for a weapon or maybe a few minutes of double xp at least a single calling card is a little bit underwhelming if you ask me but it is what it is i guess if you want to do this with your friends to kind of pass the time then go for it but uh yeah kind of cool stuff i guess shout out to speakeasy for helping me search up for the codes tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments also drop a like on the video if you did enjoy and thank you for watching until next time i'll see you later a freaking calling card man unbelievable